What's up, y'all? It's your man's S1, a.k.a. Symbolic One. And right now, you're checking out DJBooth.net. Peace. Uh, yeah, the Guilt Trip record. Um, I was in... Uh, let me see where we at. Where we're rich. I was in London with Kanye and Jay. Uh, we were in the studio together. Mike Dean was with us. Uh, Ryan Leslie was out there with us. Um, Beyonce was there with us. So we were in this room... And um, it was oh no ID was with us as well. So we were in this room together, and um, pretty much for instance, like the console, if the console was here, they had a mic set right here and a mic set right here. So the Kanye was there, Jay was there, and then right in the room, like on this step, uh, I had a little production set up. No ID had a production set up. Mike Dean. So we were up there and we was just you know doing our thing, making beats. So we would play beats for Kanye and Jay. Uh, they would yay or nay it, be like, yo. And I, Guilt Trip was actually a, a beat that I had did on the spot there. And uh, it was an idea that I did and um, played it for Kanye and Jay. And, and Jay was just like, yo, what's this? Like, we need that now. So I passed it to Mike Dean. Mike Dean added some things to it, gave it to them. Uh, Kanye laid his verse. They laid a hook. Um, and it was one of those songs where um, as the – the Watch the Throne album continued to progress. You could kind of tell it wasn't in that zone. But Kanye would always tell me, yo, we're we going to use this for something. So, uh, so there's, you know, a J, there's a J verse to that? Uh, there is a, there's half of a, he, there was like a freestyle type, a little piece of a J verse. He never, fin he never finished it. He's on like a reference track. Yeah, it's like a little reference. Yeah. Um, um, what was I saying? Oh yeah, so so the track didn't make the Watcher Throne album, but like I say, when Kanye started working on Yeezus, I was doing all these other tracks for Yeezus. Like he he had like fifteen, twenty tracks held from me, and none of those wind up making the album. But the guilt trip he pulled, and he was like, "Yo, I want to use this for the album," you know. So um, I think Travis Scott and then Kanye they did some, you know, they did some more work on the record just to kind of make it fit more the with the the Yeezy sound as far as like kind of swapping some of the drum sounds out and things but uh but yeah that was one of those seeds that was planted a while back and it it, it came you know a year and a half two years later you know it just came out kind of out of nowhere <laughs> yeah 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 y'all you know who it is the d block general it was kendrick lamar right here outside the booth shot j booth tv you watching outside the booth tv